We at GrainGuard would like to help you make sense of rocket science. Our newest innovation, the Retro Rocket, can do just that. If you have wet grain and an existing hopper bottom bin, in as little as 30 minutes, you can install a Retro Rocket for the perfect retrofit aeration solution. Our GrainGuard Retro Rocket installation demonstration video is designed to help guide you through the five quick and easy steps involved in the setup of this revolutionary new product. But before we start with the installation, let's take a brief look at the product itself. The Retro Rocket is the ideal aeration solution for your existing hopper bottom bins. With its unique, molding design, the Retro Rocket offers simple, two-person, do-it-yourself installation that can be completed in as little as 30 minutes. Please note, this video is for demonstration purposes only. For a full overview of the installation of a Retro Rocket system, please speak with your Grain Guard sales representative or dealer. Step 1. Applying Weather Stripping The first step in the installation of your Retro Rocket involves applying the provided weather stripping. Your Retro Rocket should come pre-collapsed, so all you need to do is peel the backing off each piece of weather stripping and apply it to the ends of each of the collapsed Retro Rocket panels. This will create a tight seal to ensure that air travels through the Retro Rocket's louvered surface and prevents it from escaping from between the panels themselves. Step 2. Preparing the lift system. The easiest way to move the Retro Rocket into the bin is to use a winch to assist you with the lift. Set your winch up so that the cable extends towards the manhole in the bin's hopper bottom. Now, move the collapsed Retro Rocket into place beneath the manhole and within reach of the winch cable. Step 3. Lifting the Rocket into the bin. Before attaching the winch cable, ensure that the lift system has a minimum 700 pound load rate. While the Retro Rocket weighs significantly less than this, remember, we should always take all necessary safety precautions and always place safety first. Now, while your assistant remains outside to steady the rocket, enter the bin and attach the winch cable to the eye bolts on top. With your assistant guiding the load, lift in a smooth, controlled manner using the winch. Step 4. Move the suspended rocket into place. With the retro rocket in the bin and still suspended by the winch cable, guide it into position above the bin's hopper opening. Remember to always ensure that your footing is secure when inside the hopper bottom. For the most stable footing during a retro rocket installation, GrainGuard recommends our optional hopper steps, which are now available at your local GrainGuard dealer. With the rocket in place, now you can clip the strip holding it in the collapsed position and move on to unfolding it. Step 5. Unfolding the rocket. The retro rocket comes folded in sequence. When unfolding, just follow the same sequence it was originally folded in and unfold one panel at a time. With the rocket unfolded, lower it into position so that its three legs are taking the unit's weight and remove the winch cable. Fasten the panels in place using the provided bolts. Now, bolt the legs in place and ensure the entire unit is secure. With this complete, you can now move on to installing the duct. Ensure the first part of the duct is secure, then push the second piece into place. Fasten the two pieces of the duct using the provided screws, and you're finished. In as little as 30 minutes, you've retrofitted your bin with the most versatile aeration system on the market and made sense of rocket science. For installation in even the tightest spaces, the already flexible retro rocket can also be separated into three smaller components for even greater versatility and ease of handling. For more information on the new retro rocket, including usage and capacity specifications, visit us online at grainguard.com slash retro rocket or contact your Grain Guard dealer. Grain Guard. Innovation is our tradition. Mm -hmm.